Hi everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite Mennonil Tarot. Thanks very much for joining our channel today. It really is appreciated. Thank you so much for those that have taken advantage of the five questions for $50. It is still currently running. Um, and I'm, I'm going to express one more time, please don't send me questions about health issues because I am not a doctor and legally I cannot give that advice, okay? So, um, you know, thank you so much for those that have taken advantage and have given us feedback on how their reading went, which it's been pretty positive so far, so I'm going to keep it up and keep it going in for the month of September. So if you want to take advantage of that, just shoot us through an email and we'll get back to you as soon as we can, okay? All right. All right, this reading is for Scorpio. Please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make the story fit if it's not your story. Sometimes I do say he or she. Sometimes the story might be vice versa. Scorpio, it seems to me that some of you are dealing with a frenemy, okay? And this could be in your workplace. It could be in your workplace, okay? Um, you feel like this person is your friend. There seems to be a bit of gossip going around. You know, um, you're paying too much attention to what this person is saying and they're trying to um, pretty much, um, I don't know if they don't want you to succeed or go any further in the workplace or um, they want you to make a mistake so they can look good, okay? Um, but there, there is another person that actually is a true friend in this workplace that's going to going to tell you this person has done this before, be careful, uh, watch your back, you know. And it's kind of upsetting, Scorpio, because um, I feel like you just get along with everybody and you don't expect people to um, sort of stab you in the back the way that this person um, is, is going. But you've got a card here that says don't underestimate your enemy. Listen carefully what they say, okay? Um, but whatever your friend is telling you will be beneficial for you. So be careful there, Scorpio. Okay. For some of you that are planning a business or uh, wanting to work from home or do a side hustle, it says that your business will go well and you will get rewarded for your efforts. Okay. Um, there's a lot of wealth coming your way, a lot of success in this business that you, you're doing. Um, and you should continue doing what it is because you are you are on the right track with this. So your other card says opportunities that lead to success and open paths towards good luck, okay? You're on a journey now, Scorpio. Life is about to change for you. You'll be filled with new experiences that are coming your way, meeting new people, um, opening yourself up to um, your intuition is going to help you as well, okay? So where this person is um is like trying to betray you stay away from this person you've got a no on this person okay and there is a yes on on the friend that is trying to help you so you know for some of you that are dealing with health health issues okay um health issues may arise but I'm not a doctor, it's just the card that says health issues may arise. So take care of yourself, Scorpio, and try and stay healthy, and, and especially in the mind. I, I feel like these health issues are more in the in the mind, overthinking, um, stressing out, um, looking for answers, you know, but just take it easy there, Scorpio. For those of you that are dealing with a fire sign, it, it is actually saying to you that everything will happen in divine timing. So just give it time and allow things to flow. Okay. Um, there is going to be some sort of healing in this situation. Or this person finds you very healing. Um, they may want to take you away in, or they may be going away in about uh, three days, three weeks, three months. Okay. Um, and there might be a bit of silence there between the two of you, but you're both thinking of each other, okay, because you do have an emotional attachment to this person. Um, and I do feel like there will be news that is coming in quickly, something to do with work, okay. You may have to travel for work or somebody is travelling back from work. So whatever that is for you, Scorpio. 
Mm. There's been a bit of a heartache with this with this news. Okay, you you feel like that you were on a passionate new beginning, um, and you actually are on a passionate new beginning. I kind of feel like the news, Scorpio, is that somebody is getting rid of a third party energy. Okay. Uh, something that they were attached to. This person sees you as the Empress Scorpio, you know, like stay in your power. Be wise. Don't chase anybody. You're going to get everything that you want with the Ten of Pentacles, okay? Allow the universe to do its work because it's somebody's ready to make a choice, Scorpio. All right, so don't let your emotions get in the way, Scorpio, okay? This person thinks that you're very sweet and you're very gentle and you're very kind and you're very sensitive and they, they don't want to hurt you. They just want to move on to calmer waters, okay, uh, and transit out of whatever it is that's keeping them stuck and take a journey with you, okay. They've been doing some deeper thinking, doing their research. Um, I do feel that, you know, they're very eager to talk about their decision and, you um, Everyone's kind of like looking forward to, to moving on and moving forward, okay? This energy has been a bit restless. This person has been a bit restless, you know, overthinking and um, not knowing exactly which direction to go or, or struggling to make some sort of a decision, okay? Um, they may be in a connection with somebody who is toxic, um, but that is coming to an end. Everything that you've worked for is coming together now, Scorpio, okay? I feel like you've played your cards right. And when I say played your cards right, um, I feel like it's more that you just, you just did you. You just did you and you just thought, you know what? I'm just going to be me. You like me, you like me, you don't like me, see you later, okay? But I don't see you wanting to change who you are. You like who you are, okay? Um, generally, you're very happy. Generally, you're very happy. And this is why you, you draw a lot of toxic people towards you, Scorpio. But generally, you are very, very ha a happy person. Your energy just flows. People just want to be a part of that. Your intuition is just really spiked in the month of September. So go with that, okay? But here it comes, Scorpio. A beautiful offer that is coming your way, okay? Somebody that wants to uh, open their heart to you, somebody that wants to tell you how they feel about you, okay? We have an emperor here, so this is somebody that's taking charge of their own life, okay? Um, they want a victory with you, Scorpio. They want to form some kind of structure. You are the wish fulfillment. You are the opportunity. You are what they want, okay? Um, this person is like, they just love everything about you. They see that you shine. I feel like when you and this person get together, the energy is just really happy. You know, there's a happy energy about it. It's calming, it's relaxing, it's happy, it's loving. I, I don't know, it's just beautiful. But Somebody was not listening to their inner voice for a while. They weren't paying attention to the signs. They weren't listening to their intuition, okay? They were just, you know, stalling, being indecisive, not having the strength to, to go through what they know they're going to have to go through. So they chose peace instead and chose to carry these heavy burdens, okay? Um, but something is going to be released. Something is coming to an end, okay? Okay. Somebody is going to release the heavy burden, all right? I feel like this person doesn't want to hurt you, Scorpio, okay? Um, because I feel like at times they, they may have hurt you by constantly showing you that they have other choices. Yeah. There's a big change coming in. Always expect the unexpected, Scorpio, when this change comes in, okay? Bit of a reality check coming in for somebody, all right? Something is going to be revealed here. And um, I do see that subconsciously, you know, um, you may have thought you were like having an illusion about all this. Maybe my feelings are not correct. Maybe they're, I, they're not feeling the same way I'm feeling. Maybe it was just an illusion. But, but yeah, Scorpio, 
Don't ever tell yourself, okay? You should celebrate this love that you have with this person, okay? Because that, that, that's what they want to do. Scorpio, so I feel like somebody's been really thinking, taking the time out and you know, to, to get the answers. And it might be during the time of travel that they they're thinking because they're definitely gonna miss you, Scorpio, during that time of travel. Okay, so I do feel it's been a long time coming, but there has always been a plan to come towards you, Scorpio. Okay. Um some of you Scorpios are really enjoying the results of all your hard work, okay, but um, is there's a money flow that is coming in, so keep doing what you're doing, okay? Yeah, somebody's looking at you, Scorpio. The King of Wands is a you know dynamic energy, a leader, somebody that that really sees you as somebody who um, just enjoys life and you know has no expectation and just you know lives day by day and but. You do have plans, Scorpio. It's not like you live day by day. You do have plans. You have plans to travel. You have plans to to do a lot of things. It's only when you sort of like go into that withdraw energy that plans are all shut down. You're just taking time out. You just don't want to be disturbed. You're rejuvenating yourself, okay? And getting your intuition back on track. But if your intuition is telling you that this person is eventually going to come towards you. There may be some sort of um, justice going on here with the legal system, okay? But um, this is your soulmate. This is somebody you're going to build a home, a foundation, um, you know, so be ready for that opportunity that you work for. There's going to be some sort of celebration, um, you know, a lot of romance, something you've been waiting for for a long time. So um, keep focusing on your goals until this comes in for you. I feel like that, you know, you're looking so good in the month of September, Scorpio. This person can't keep their eyes off you, okay? <clears throat> but you're looking after yourself, and that's why this person now wants to come in and make this offer to you, okay? Very intuitive, Scorpio. So is this other person. Look, I really feel like, you know, the sun is going to shine for you, Scorpio. Whatever it is that you're going through, okay, um, your, your, your mental health is, is very important, okay? It's very important that your mental health is very balanced, that you get the, the, the fresh air that you need, you know, that you get a little bit of exercise in your life. It's really important for you to take control, okay? But for some reason in the month of September, you're looking so radiant, okay? I don't know if you're doing a beauty regime or you've lost weight or whatever it is, but people are looking at you and especially this person. So don't be surprised, uh, Scorpio, if you have quite a few opportunities coming in. But one in particular, one in particular, okay, wants to have this happiness, wants to have this four of wands with you, okay, getting a very strong fire sign, but it doesn't have to be, this person is very passionate towards you, this person really, really, really wants to be with you, okay, so um, get out of your head, Scorpio, just get out of your head, okay, um, because there you go, you've got the ten of cups, you've got the victory, and you've got fast forward communication coming in, all right. I feel for a while there was a lot of confusion for this person. Maybe they were stuck somewhere. Maybe they were in a marriage, okay. But you were the wish fulfillment. But there is going to be some sort of grief and loss that is going on here. But a decision is going to be made, okay. For those of you that have been in a third party situation and uh, have been waiting, this is the last year that you wait. So if a decision doesn't come in for you, um, sometime next year you'll be ending this for some of you you already ended it I, I can tell you you've already ended it um, but for some of you you haven't okay um, but if you are waiting and you don't get this answer by the end of this year sometime probably around about 
I'm going to say um, June next year, you'll, you'll be done. You'll be done if you don't get the answer because you've been waiting a long time, okay? And it, it, it's not that far away for some of you, but don't don't um, waste your life sitting around. You need to you need to get on with life, and you need to experience life, and you need to just keep going, okay? What is meant for you will never pass you, Scorpio. But you know, I feel like this person is keeping a few things to themselves. They don't really want to tell you everything, but they do have a plan. And they have a secret, okay? And they're going to work hard at it. They're working hard to make this happen because I feel like they really, really want to be with you, okay? Um, but there's also, you know, you need to focus on building your finances, Scorpio. You need to focus on building your comfort. And you need to focus on where, you know, life is going to take you. What's your plan? Where are you going? Don't sit around just waiting day by day for things to happen because a lot of you are just sitting around doing nothing, okay? So, Scorpio, take yourself out because there's a destiny for you. And with, I, I'm not getting a past person here. I'm getting this is a, a present person and or somebody that you're about to meet, okay? You could meet this person next three to four weeks the most, Okay, so get yourself out there and um, enjoy this because it seems like a very long-term commitment coming in for you, Scorpio. So be careful of this person in your workplace, the sheep in wolf's clothing, okay? But if you're running your own business, you are going to be successful. Things are going to be very productive, okay? And a lot of wealth and success is coming into your life. This person may end up working with you like you you and this person may end up having a small business together, okay, which is going to be very fruitful. All right, everyone, we wish you all the best and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.